He was convicted and later sentenced to death for a 1994 murder in West Philadelphia. But now, 30 years later, 54-year-old Daniel Gwynn is set to become a free man. Today, Philadelphia's district attorney's office had the case thrown out and dropped charges against Gwynn thanks to new evidence. CBS News Philadelphia's Ray Strickland has the story. At any moment, 54-year-old Daniel Gwynn will walk out of prison for the first time as a free man in 30 years. Today, a Philadelphia judge granted a motion by the district attorney's office to drop all charges against Gwynn because, in their own words, there was a staggering amount of evidence that was suppressed during Gwynn's trial back in 1994, from a faulty confession made by Gwynn, unreliable witness testimony, to an alternate suspect. All of that was not known during Gwen's trial decades ago that could have helped find him not guilty. Gwen was accused of starting a fire at an abandoned building in West Philadelphia that killed Marcia Smith. According to the DA, the prosecution in Gwen's case relied on witness testimony. The witnesses told police he started the fire. According to the DA, the police told the prosecutor at the time that witnesses picked Gwen out of a photo lineup. This photo lineup was never admitted as evidence during Gwen's trial, and in fact, Gwen's photo was never in this lineup that was shown to witnesses. Also, it turned out Gwen gave a confession that was not factually consistent with how the fire started. The DA believes he was terrified and told police what they wanted to hear. All of this, according to the DA, leads them to believe Gwen is more than likely not the person who killed Marcia Smith. It's mostly for us a day of tremendous relief and sadness that a guy like him, an innocent soul, uh, would have spent that amount of time awaiting his execution and then, uh, you know, languishing in prison. And the DA says the victim's family in this case was not opposed to Gwen's release and that it's unlikely that this case against Gwen will be retried. As for Gwen himself, he is set to be released from SCI Phoenix at any moment. It could be an hour, it could be longer, but whatever time that is, we do expect to speak with him. Reporting at SCI Phoenix, Ray Strickland, CBS News, Philadelphia.